TJ's Sandwich Shop in Fayetteville, Arkansas. That's my food review for the day. All right, welcome back everybody. So I am at uh, a new restaurant here in Fayetteville called TJ's Sandwich Shop. And uh, they had quite a bit of stuff on the menu, but uh, they have one thing on there that I, that's one of my favorites. And it was the uh, um, Philly's cheesesteak. And so that's what I went with. Uh, but they they call theirs TJ's cheese steak. So, but the same same thing. So this is what it looks like. Got a lot of meat on it. Uh, it did not come cut in half. I cut that in half myself just now. Uh, so I mean, I don't see any peppers. And I don't see any cheese. <laughs> I, all I see is meat. <laughs> all right, let's, let's give it a try. And see what we think. It's got a lot of juice, liquid, for some reason. Philly cheesesteaks don't have liquid. What's up, what's up with that? All right. It looks like it's going to be messy. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure about this one. It's a little spicy. The meat's a little tough. And I'm not sure what all the liquid is from. I'm not, it's not definitely not a Philly cheesesteak that I've ever had before. But I don't know, let's see. Try another bite. There's a mushroom. Found one mushroom so far. So it's kind of like, to me, that the uh, steak was cooked in like a mushroom gravy. Almost. So I'm not sure about this one. I'm, I'm not, not digging it too much. So uh, I want to finish it off and see see what I think, and I'll get back with y'all on my review here in just a minute. All right, welcome back everybody. So I finished off the uh, uh, cheese steak or Philly cheese steak, whichever one you want to call it. So uh, my thoughts on it: uh, I did come to the conclusion that uh, they did cook the steak in like mushroom gravy, uh, which wasn't too awful bad. Uh, but it did have a really, well, I ain't gonna say really, it did have, it was spicy. For me, anything spicy is really spicy. Uh, I'm not sure what the spice was coming from because I didn't see any peppers on it. Uh, the only thing I could think of was uh, the black pepper. And uh, another downside is uh, they put your sandwich on this paper bottom. And of course the gravy gets it soggy and it starts tearing on you and getting in your food. Uh, uh, another thing is with the gravy, the bread gets soggy. So um, I don't like soggy bread. It's not very good. Uh, but the bun was toasted, uh, but like I said, where the gravy was at, it got soggy. So uh, overall it wasn't, too bad, but uh, Philly cheesesteak is one of those things that you really don't need to try to change it. Leave it, leave it like it is. It's better that way, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think it was time to give this thing a rating, and I think I'm gonna give it. Hmm, I think I'm gonna give it a six out of ten. I think that's pretty fair. Yeah. What was the price? Um. And the price on it wasn't too awful bad. You saw how the size of the sandwich. Uh, the price on it was seven ninety five, so it really wasn't too bad. So I give a thumbs up on that one. <laughs> All right, so I did order another sandwich, of course. You know, fat boy. I think I have two sandwiches, right? 
All right, so like I said, I got this other sandwich, uh, and this one is called the uh, Meaty, uh, Meaty Southwestern. So again, I had to cut it in half. Uh, it looks like there's a ton of meat on this sandwich. Uh, a lot of cheese. Uh, I'm not sure, it looks like roast beef. I'm not sure what the type of meat that is. There's a ton of meat on it though. And meat and cheese, that's all I see. <laughs> Uh, and, and the bun is toasted. So, let's give it a try. See what we think. Yeah. <laughs> Meat and cheese. That's it. <laughs> it's very dry. Uh, Got to choke it down. <laughs> Holy cow. All right. I want to eat it and get back with y'all here in a minute. <laughs> Give my rating on it. <sighs> okay. So for the, uh, what was that called? The meaty Midwestern. Oh my God. Is there anything good I can say about it? Uh, the meat was dry. The cheese was a big old clump of melted, processed, nasty cheese. The bread was dry. There was nothing good about this sandwich at all. Uh, I didn't even eat all of it. <laughs> I got got some bread left over. I couldn't even. I, I could. Oh my god. I was. That's one of the, I, I make a better sandwich than that. Jeez. Oh, that, no, that was no good. So, uh, the beefy, meaty Midwestern gets a big old zero for me. Zero out of ten. Actually, I won't get it less than that. Negative ten out of ten. How about that? Yeah. So, but if you like meat and you like globs of processed nasty cheese... You may like it. I didn't. I don't like it at all. But I did get one more thing and uh, asked them what their soups were. Uh, they had a tomato soup, which I can't stand tomato soups. So I didn't order that. But their soup for the day was a. Uh, is that all just roast chicken? Uh, it was a uh, roasted chicken soup. So that's what I got here. So, anyway, that's. Uh, I forgot to mention uh, that. Uh, sandwich, the meaty Midwestern. Yeah, same price, seven ninety five. It wasn't worth it. But I got a cup of soup here, and this soup uh, it was pretty dang good, don't it? So the soup was after taxes and all is three something, which yeah, that's a little pricey, but hey, what the heck? Let's try it out and see. Too bad. Maybe I should have dumped my sandwich in the soup. All right, I'm gonna eat this and I'll be right back, y'all. All right, so my grilled, is it grilled cheese or grilled, uh, <laughs> grilled chicken soup tastes more like a watered down cream of broccoli with chicken chunks in it. I think that's a pretty good description. Yeah. So, it's taking too long with a spoon, so I'm just drinking it. But it is good and hot on a cold day. That'd be really good. Warm your little bones up. Uh, so, let me, let me finish this just a little bit. Yeah, so, so far, I think I, if I, if I was hungry enough and I was in the area, I'd probably stop back by here and get a uh, Philly cheesesteak. I definitely would not get the meaty Midwestern. Uh, 
the soup. Not bad. Uh, I've heard that the tomato soup was really good also. Uh, but I don't like tomato soup, so I didn't get any. Uh, I think the soup was the best part about this meal. Uh, the, the meaty Midwestern was definitely the worst. So for the rating of the uh, grilled chicken soup, like I said, it was the best of all three. So I'm gonna give it yeah, eight out of 10. I think that's really, really fair on that one. Uh, but yeah, like I said, if I was hungry and I was in the area, I might would stop back by here. Uh, there's definitely better places to eat, but this one was fairly cheap. So, I guess if you're in Fayetteville, check out uh, TJ's Sandwich Shop. Can't miss it. There's a big old robot on the side of the building. Bye, y'all.